This is Mac Voices TV. This edition of Mac Voices TV at Macworld 2011 is brought to you by Smile, the makers of PDF Pen and Text Expander, tools for your Mac, iPhone, and iPad. Download free demos of these and more at smilesoftware.com. Hi, I'm Chuck Joyner, and this is Mac Voices TV in San Francisco at Macworld 2011. We're in the YX booth talking to Katie about ZBoost. Katie, welcome to Mac Voices TV. Hi, thanks for having me. Thank you for, uh, for talking to us. So ZBoost, I saw you all at the media reception the other night, and this sounds like one of those solutions that a lot of us could use because we still have coverage issues uh, with our iPhones, even though Verizon is now getting into the fray. Yes, absolutely. Over 70% of cell phone users have cell phone signal issues in their homes and in their offices. So this is a great solution for families who just want to have better cell phone coverage inside their homes, as well as teleworkers that are working from their home offices, anyone that just wants to have better cell phone signal for voice and for data. Katie, let's just be honest. We've seen a lot of different cell phone boosters. You know, they claim to perform all kinds of magic. Um, AT&T has offered micro cells that tap into your internet connection, which is always a little questionable. And I've heard some, some work great, some don't work so well. Exactly how does ZBoost work and what does it do? So ZBoost is a little bit different from the femtocells and microcells because it's just solely relying on your cell phone signal. There's an antenna outside your home or in a window that's picking up on the cell phone signal and bringing it inside your home to our base unit, which works as an amplifier and booster for the cell phone signal and cleans it up and gives you better signal inside your home. Okay, so it's basically a, a, a transceiver. It receives and then retransmits the signal inside? Right, and we have some patent, pet, patented technologies on our base units that clean it up and filter it and make it better for you and your family to use your devices that you have and that you want to use inside your homes. But this is a, um, a voice-only solution. It is not for data. No, it's for, it's for voice and it's for data. It also works with um, wireless data cards. And so it's a solution for all of your devices inside your home. So if I have an AT&T uh, account on, for my iPhone, for my iPad, for all my iDevices, ZBoost can theoretically give me a better signal. Absolutely. How? Well, <laughs> again, it's patented technology, but we're taking we're taking the signal from outside of your home using various different antennas. For our Soho home unit, we have a high gain antenna that actually is going to go up on your roof or in your attic and take capture that cell phone signal where it's strongest and bring it inside your home. It's connected to our base unit using coax cable. And then that base unit, you're going to put it in your office, in a kitchen, in a central location where you really want the cell phone signal to be better. And it's going to boost inside your home. And so the Soho boosts up to 3,000 square feet. Am I doing anything on my cell phone or my iPhone or my iPad to, you know, once I've installed this in my home, or do I just turn it on and it finds it and goes? Exactly. You just turn on your phone, you plug in the ZBoost, and you're ready to go. There's no setup. There's no registering phones. You can use any U.S. frequencies except for Nextel all at the same time. So you can boost an AT&T iPhone. You can boost a Droid. You can boost anything except for a Nextel inside your home without thinking about it. You mentioned you know, an external antenna for outside the house, but you also have a solution for those of us who don't really want to get up on our roof. Yes, we absolutely do. Um, our ZBoost Metro is one of our newer products, and this is actually the external antenna. It's the signal antenna that you're actually just going to put in your window and position it based on where you're getting the best signal. And instead of having to get up on your roof, this is a great alternative for people that live in condos or live in apartments or just don't have the ability to get up on their roof. And so it provides the same type of solution, and this product boosts 1,500 square feet. And is, I mean, it's great if you have one room that you really need signal in and that you're just not getting. And it boosts up to 1,500 square feet. So it's a really a great solution with even less of a setup. Okay, so both of these sort of make sense to me as to how they would work because they're powered devices. Yes. But how about you have one for the car? We do uh, have and this one for this the is car. this is a really rather intriguing idea okay. because all of us drop signals in our cars. Right. And so with our Zebu's car unit, this is the amplifier system that you're going to put on the baseboard of your car, just on the floor, and it's plugged in using a cigarette adapter. 
for your power source. And you've got a little external antenna with a little magnetic piece on the end that you put on the outside of your car. And then a patch antenna that you connect to the amplifier also and put on your dashboard or up in the front seat where you're going to be using your cell phone. And so it uses the same idea of capturing the signal from outside where it's strongest and bringing it inside. And for this, it's bringing it inside of your car, your SUV, or your RV. It sounds very simple. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's a very simple idea that ZBoost and YX have perfected into making our ZBoost product line. Uh, what kind of pricing are we talking about for each unit? Um, so the MSRP on our home unit is $399. MSRP on our metro unit is $299, and MSRP on the car unit is $179. Katie, thank you so much for uh, introducing us to Z-Boost. Thank you so much. I'm Chuck Joyner. We'll be back with more from the show floor at Macworld 2011 in San Francisco. Until the next time, thanks for watching. Voices TV is part of the Mac Voices Group and a member of Mac Level 10.